Well, Tom and the iFish crew have been out fishing today off Flinders, Victoria, targeting gummy sharks. And as you can see, they had fantastic success. Now, this fish, it was trunked immediately. When I say trunked, still got the tail. No guts at all, put in a nice slurry, and it is in magnificent condition for filleting. Now, if you get a fillet fish, make sure you do it properly, and you've got to use the right tools for the job. That's why I'm using these beautiful F-Dick knives by Oppenheimer. They are so sharp, it's wrong. So this particular knife, just fantastic. I go in there and literally remove that pectoral fin. Flip it over and do this one exactly the same. Don't need them at all. Then I come back and flip this over. Now, gummy sharks have two dorsal fins. That one, we take off like that. This one back here is gone as well. So that one's off. Down the back here, there's a little one got to come off. And then it's important you've got to get rid of these belly flaps because they make life very difficult. So what I like to do, I'm going to pull this around to make it easy for you. You basically start at the back here. You get in behind that fin and you literally cut in. And look how sharp this knife is. Now there's a natural crease along there. And I just follow that crease. And I literally cut that off all the way along. That's the belly flap. We can use that later. Spin this around. I'll go the other way now. How good's this trunk? And literally, sorry. I'm actually coming with this hand just to make it easier for camera. Look how sharp that knife is. Gummy sharks are so tough. And I just follow that natural crease. You see that there? All the way up and take that beautiful belly flap off. Now we literally have a trunk and it's ready for filleting. So I'll bring it around to make it nice and easy. You'll see on the end here, and this is what I go for my different knife. They say a different knife for every job, just like a golfer uses a different club. You'll see there is my little bit of cartilage. And what I want to do is come in right on top of that and literally follow the back of the fillet. You'll see if you come around the back here, I've actually got a natural line. So I've literally got to my dorsal fin, there's a natural line that runs down the back of the gummy. I'm going nice and slow and steady, just slowly pushing the angle down, and I'm following that natural line all the way. You want to try and get as much fish off this as possible because it tastes so good. I'm going to slide that up all the way to the end, and there we have a magnificent fillet of gummy shark. Look at that, just sensational. That is all fish, a little bit of cartilage here we can pick out, not much waste at all. And remember, a sharp knife is a safe knife, and these things are incredibly safe. This boating and fishing tip was brought to you by boatsales.com.au.